All right, today is still 31 minutes to May 16, 2022. Uh, this video is because Joe Biden, because of Vladimir Putin, Let me present you to someone. It was maybe the second person on the picture with me and Putin in the United States of America in 1995. A second person, second American that would have been like introduced like a biggest politician to me. Right through me basically to Vladimir Putin, let's put it this way, because it was Putin that have whereabouts with through me, literally, in the U.S. in 1995 when it all started. You know who the guy was? His name was Joe Biden. That's your dear president of the United States of America. That's a guy that is doing his best to rescue Ukraine because it's just there was no other. There was no other man than a guy like this. He's the most qualified. He's the one that qualified. It's just like every person that did create problems to me. And I really couldn't relate to one that have managed to obtain important public position. And not only in the U.S., but also abroad in some countries, too. So, you know, that's the kind of game. See nothing, heard nothing, know nothing game. Zero friend, zero amigo. Cancer, spine breaking, that kind of stuff. Stay jobless for the rest of your life. And wait. They haven't done anything for 28 years, then play down and I'm not saying expectations but they, they try to kill my will for life and any question to million issues they presented me with sick MK Ultra scenarios that I had such as and so uh, and this is how it ends or and so I made it. It was always no. No, but. No, but. This shit went on for no less than 26 years. Also hijacked from the US to Russia. And so this video is dedicated to Brittany Bridger. Now, this is actually dedicated foremost to individual I have stated. And what I consider is a Black Lives Matters. And that's basically people, and I'm not going to say people of color, but I'm going to say African-American people, if you like, that had exactly less than zero compassion for me and have sided, in fact, with those against whom they historically have claimed injustice for the sake of moolah, you know, bucks, green lies kill lies murder torture kills I'm sure you understand indifferent from all these people despite my saying it was not that she was okay that I feel sorry for her and this and that was Brittany Gringer and audio about one I have recorded just yesterday Yesterday I did, I did go for a walk and I did this at uh, Schoenpeter. You're going to hear birds in the forest, cars passing through, uh, bells right there from the church. You see, they were catching me with the news in respect to Brittany Gringer. Let's go a little bit to the internet here. On Yahoo, they were catching me and catching me and catching me and catching me with this stuff. Boy, 
they were catching me with this stuff for no less than I don't know maybe two weeks they back and forth back and forth with this news about merchant of death and this what you see right now that looks like a lady she did not look like a lady when I was with her on a boat and with her what became her future wife uh, she acted like a lady like somebody who eventually was interested in me when she was in Russia and to tell you the truth that she's not bad looking at all and all that uh, now I was into her girlfriend whom instead she married which it's okay with me uh, even at one point in time I was thinking about just getting both really <laughs> um, life is too fucking serious to be serious all the time that's the way it was however under MK Ultra um, and I think this is her piece of meat that's how she got at me uh, by basically demonstrating her catch and then she married her in front of me and stuff like this this is actually real this is all good to me as I stated uh, she acted like a boy though at times and it was violent probably she had to prove to her catch that she is where that matrimony you know it's just I didn't resent any of that stuff now I do resent the part you're gonna hear me talking in English and it's just an audio I have audio recorded yesterday thinking about this where this whole thing is going it's not good yeah because this merchant of death this Russian guy this guy that the US government suggests they will they, they will swap the two with one another this guy was involved in this crime since 1995 his family his daughter whatever you want this guy took me with him to Africa it's where he met with the CIA too and so on I did already wrote on my blog about this individual listen um, I'm gonna put it this way I wouldn't even be doing this stuff because he is none of my business and as far as her I do love to see her rather doing good than bad I don't wish her absolutely anything bad uh, but the problem here is that Central Intelligence Agency that's precisely Joe Biden and the Russians precisely Vladimir Putin tried to set me up and it did not go in between without her involvement as well of trying to help them out to fuck me up as much as possible the whole thing however was supported by what I consider as black lives matters and I'm talking about just the wealthy people like Serena Williams uh, her sister Venice Williams Mike Tyson that's the type of people I'm talking about I'm talking about like top this African American or uh, I just say people with extreme views as sort of extremists you got plenty of them talking about Michael Jordan here talking about Michael Johnson here talking about the upper class of African American community uh, and not so much everything about upper class but leaders of this human rights in the United States of America the concern foremost really claims against those that I don't deny at all 
if you watch my website I am trying to side with you as much as possible against those who have exploited them but you know guys once you start to get into my business with idea as I was told by this black people in the US well she smuggled proofs of abuse documents audio recordings whatever which one of the three it was not said to me about abuse that took against you in Russia to the US when you say the stuff like this you know when you say the stuff like this and you're saying that's what I was brainwashed with you know you wouldn't even do this for us you wouldn't even do, do you wouldn't even do this for us ha huh. you have so much blood of mine on your palms on your hands that it's unbelievable what you have done to me with your Bill Cosby criminal show and expressed during claims for injustice, for racial injustice in the U.S. And I don't even consider myself as white, to tell you straight. I'm Eastern European. And I did express interest, by the way, for black women. Black women, no, it wasn't only one. It was more than that. And at the same time, you're taking advantage of somebody who comes from a small country connecting yourself literally you know Brittany Gringer that's really not nice connecting yourself uh, she connecting yourself literally with a Vladimir Putin who is at this point in time liberating with a can cannibalism with a rape of the children Ukrainian children a Ukraine he is denazifying, denazifying Ukraine right now with a rape, with a murder, with a butchery, uh, with a genocide, extermination. And that you guys are thinking about future relations between Vladimir Putin and yourself, just like you have collaborated with him since 1995. You were the reason for all these problems. You were the one who cooked all these problems. You, from American side, you came and hugged Putin. Uh, you're the one where he found his refuge in the U.S. first. In your human rights. Till you realize that he is up to something else. But it doesn't really matter. Again, because it appears to me you did not realize that much. Because it's just Ukraine that is on the table right now. And you learn that kind of attitude literally through my case and so I really resent you that it's you who have video recorded yourself Joe Biden have video recorded himself conditioning me pointing me out this is my only way out of what you did I ruined me 28 years for the sake of someone Vladimir Putin with whom you believe I will not release this video the truth about you will again establish the same shit you did in 1995 I'm not going to say it disappoints me um, I'm just going to say Vladimir Putin Gringer, Brittany Gringer, all video recorded themselves next to me, claiming me. Brittany Gringer told me about the swap with a Victor Bout. Already, I have no idea what the year was. 2019, 2018, they had me. Uh, Joe Biden, too, that, no, that's something, that's a news you're not going to see, you're just going to let that go. But I'm going to break you down and demonstrate you how little this president of yours from United States of America really is. This real good friend, 
of Vladimir Putin. I'm gonna demonstrate to you why this guy actually is a, such a good friend of Vladimir Putin. And I have to do it because you guys did video recorded yourself next to me. What exactly that means for me, for my case. Joe Biden is rewriting me. He is erasing my existence. Ha, I do suffer cancer issues, serious cancer issues, unemployment, spine problems I have experienced in Poland do not go away. I'm in a very bad shape, actually. Maybe even my days are counted. I don't know. Joe Biden definitely counts them. Literally through the war with Ukraine, where he is depicting himself as a hero, as a savior of the world. That's basically number one. He engaged in abuse. He engaged in a torture for no less than 28 years now. And I really can't see the difference between him and Donald Trump, to tell you the truth. That's, for one thing, what Joe Biden is doing. He is erasing me from the picture with a war that goes on in Ukraine. Eventually, top American Democrats, just as Republicans, hope I somehow will be gone, will disappear from the picture. That's one thing that bothers me about Joe Biden. Now, as you're about to hear in the audio, there's a whole a lot more that bothers me about Joe Biden. The second biggest issue I have with Joe Biden is by him video recording himself, that also goes to Brittany Gringer, with me, stating me that The swipe will take place in the future. That's very bad for me. Uh, and the second thing is, she told me as well about the proofs that she uh, took across the border from Russia to the US. Brittany Gringer was sent as a gift to me. I was told by George Bush who was trying to desperately push me as well into the arms of the Black Lives Matters with idea to rescue me as my help, as my aid. That's what he stated. But this is what he stated when he was already far out of the picture. This guy caused me so many problems that I can't kind count. This guy served two presidencies, ruined my life, literally in a single sentence, if I express myself. And as I stated, she was no angel. My being quiet about this kind of stuff, about what you see right here, puts me at stakes at all government levels in every instance. Uh, and on the other hand, is that kind of stuff, again, that's used to condition a democratic party potentially and other political party if I come out with and so when you do this kind of stuff when when you have this 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 going on and on the other side you have Vladimir Putin on you you fuck me up you I can no longer keep my mouth shut so I stated lots of great stuff about Brittany Gringer on my website this is not about my being a Russophobe or something like this. Um, I don't really care for life in Russia. Uh, this is not about, truly about any other issue than what I have stated. You placed me in a danger because of this stuff. You are the one, you placed me in a danger with this kind of stuff. Uh, and further, even more so because you claimed that you, you claimed me that you are in there because of me. Can you imagine? You are in there. All this shit that's being silent with so many people going in and out of the Russia. You, black girl, 
I'm not gonna be your hostage. I will not be your fucking hostage. I was your hostage, you know, until 2010, 2011 when my film broke. And now we are talking about 16 years of torture I endured because of you black people in the United States of America. I still kept my mouth shut. You discriminated against me. You with son from the Martin Luther King involved engaged in extreme prejudice, racism against me. And for you to come up with a shit like this that it's I because of whom you are jailed, it's I because of whom swap with a Russian criminal that was involved in this stuff. Now, must take place uh, for me personally, for what I stated, I hope it even takes place because really I don't give a three fucks about you. Uh, I, I actually wish you the best to both of you. I don't give a fuck about this Victor Bout or this girl here, Brittany Gringer. It's good that you are both doing okay. I was not after you. Uh, but I'd be damned, man, if this Merchant of Death, the last time I saw one was in 2005 as I walked with him along the ocean drive in Miami Beach before I left the U.S. with the SEA under Operation MK Ultra again. He, this, this, you're crazy people. You don't fucking understand that this people... He had his lifestyle in the U.S. before he was even sentenced in the jail. And I completely doubt about his jail and everything else because of that kind of stuff. These people had a completely different arrangements with the Central Intelligence Agency. They get caught, whatever it is, whatever, whatever happens. Uh, trust me, they still have space for negotiations because of intergovernmental contracts they 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 keep operations running behind behind the public curtain you you don't know anything about what goes on there i saw how this stuff goes and so you don't do that kind of stuff girl i hope they get you out of there but under no circumstances am i gonna respond uh, because it was like you're gonna allow this one this black person is going to save you, that black person is going to save you, and that one is going to save you, and I don't know what who the fuck is going to save you. At least that one is going to save you. Uh, it, it make, they made me, portray, they tried to portray me, paint me like some kind of racist that he would just not allow black person to come anywhere near or some shit like this. That's just not true. The truth is what I stated, basically. You screwed up this badly. That's what this that's what this stuff is all about. Now there's some other stuff about the Joe Biden. Because Joe Biden is not exactly what you think Joe Biden is. And so, you know what I'm gonna do at this point in time? I'm just gonna play you an audio which I have recorded yesterday. And I really don't think that it's a good recording worth to spend time this ten minutes and thirty seconds. It come out that this man, Joe Biden, doesn't even want to be a U.S. president anymore. It comes out that Mr. Joe Biden anticipated I would be the one who's going to bail him out and leave Ukraine wide open for Russian attack. And you, blacks, your civil rights, which I do not deny the need for those. I'm not the person who is up to you. This is not what I am all about. It's just that don't do the stuff like this to people. Be honest with the people. Treat people like a people. I'm not saying treat them like yourself, but treat them like a people. Just listen to this 10 minute, 30 second clip I have uh, audio recorded at the end of this. You're also going to hear me saying Something about the lady I met on my way. A lady that works at crematorium 
and even maybe I don't know about the chimney if I'm gonna mention uh, but I did explain that earlier uh, and so that was in respect to my father who was hospitalized today I knew it what's gonna happen the next day that's basically what I'm trying to say and I did also describe that on a during this clip uh, at that location this is a few kilometers from here this location in the forest okay so listen up good this man Joe Biden is trying to use you Black Lives Matters you black people to get Donald Trump back on the picture he can say anything he wants but they have a completely different plans running Brittany Granger, Joe Biden, therefore, he alone confirmed Brittany Granger's exchange for the Russian. Hmm. I cannot recall his name who was involved in this stuff, but a trait with a Russian gangster that used to smuggle weaponry to Africa, uh, refer to one as dead and I don't know what, and in fact I was brought to him by Americans uh, to Russia to meet his wife daughter you know that kind of stuff then that he was captured uh, and held imprisoned in the US justice system just when I exited US I don't know that probably was in 2006 2005 he walked along me along my alongside myself on an ocean drive, I don't know whether they use the silicon masks or not, but that really matters not. A trade was well, a ranger already a hat. Uh, if I would come up with a stuff like this, because Brittany Granger was a whole lot involved also in the torture. I met her in Russia from Texas, George Bush stated me, sent her there to help me out, uh, was really young when met me, claimed that want to marry me, then she claimed racial issues uh, and expressed interest for same-sex marriage, to which quite a violent stuff I had to participate on occasions that would not even be able to discern between male and female. That's how she behaved. Uh, I just wished that I that she told me that she was female too and that she liked me. Uh, if she did that, that would be a match because I liked her girlfriend, whom she ended up marrying. That's really crazy. Uh, and in that case, it would be the three of us, but it didn't go that way. It was just crazy violent shit. That means that everything was already prearranged in respect to all that stuff. Wanna marry and that kind of BS. Too much of that went on. That's how she built her career in Russia. On the other hand, she claimed some other stuff that would be like really, really completely beneficial to me if that will ever be the truth. And that's something I just don't know because it's totally something that's like going and catch pigeon on the roof, basically something like this with bare hands, climbing up there and going and throwing himself on that. Now. What the Russians wanted, because it wasn't only Joe Biden who knew about this, but it was also Vladimir Putin who knew about this. You see, in this case, we have exchange. 
situation. What the Russians wanted uh, eventually was for me to oppose this, uh, come out and protest against this exchange, prisoner exchange. By the way, today is May 14, 2022, and we are close to 2100 hours. Um, 15 to 2100 hours so that you know I could be whatever rated as racist or whatever and so on and so forth Russophobe and racist basically so that's my definition of Joe Biden as someone that really can be so much trusted you see he is a Democrat representative but it doesn't really matter to him the principles he's using basically or whom he is sacrificing throwing under the bus we know that the friend of vladimir putin is donald trump no other who plans on presidential campaign in 2024 if you understand me i'm sure you understand this issue and so by my going out there and protest black girl who by the way also knew all this stuff she apparently is, was imprisoned. If I did go and do that kind of stuff, I would have ruined myself, you know. I, I, uh, I would actually give a green light to the Nazism. That's why Joe Biden, in my book, is classified as a Nazi. That's a twisted game. But... Whatever I understood on that MK Ultra, make no mistake, I understood also in real time. But I understood a little bit more what they wanted to tell me. That became apparent. So you see, it's about a case similar to Serena Williams. Serena Williams who threw herself between Nike, therefore the money uh, Nike owed me, that's what Nike claimed. And you're talking astronomical amounts of money. You're not talking about what Serena Williams at the time said, I don't know, a few hundred million, whatever. And marital issues. Claiming me basically that she earned that money for us and stuff like this. This is completely insane shit. They wanted me to use to describe it myself. Of course, I'm not going to do it. But this is just to note that, you know, that's all. It was like this, not that I would, whatever, uh, but that's exactly the way it was. So, I think the crookery is going to go on. Joe Biden is going to go and discredit himself. And we're going to have a problem. Especially it would have been wrong if I would come up with the stuff like this because of the stuff that I didn't even say. And uh, truly, uh, I don't know what to say. And all I know is that she told me she's going to be imprisoned that they will do stuff like this. Biden told me that. Putin alone told me that. And even blame it on me. You see how dangerous this situation is. These people video recorded themselves in front of me. And are just looking the way out to find a Nazi. Regardless of it. And in this case you have a black hatred issues that cause tremendous harm to me. That's one of the things. With the lies. And you have what would be a knowledge as a Russophobe on the Russian side. So this is a very, very complicated Joe Biden-like issue. That could come really handy to somebody else, as I stated. And just really fuck even the world up and so on and so forth. So this, this guy, that's just Joe Biden. That's how he does it. Like he didn't have time to do different way. Like she had to stay there. Like there was no other way to rescue her 
Uh, and like she didn't know about it, right? Okay. Very important for me to say. I'll try to recall. Yeah. Father is at home at this point. And uh, mother fed him today with uh, what I posted on the on the on the blog, with the sweets and stuff like this before he went to sleep and that kind of stuff. And I know, I see I served this girl in a brown combinaison, pants and stuff like this that went for the job. She was unemployed for some time, maybe a year or two or something like this. Really desperate to get a job. I remember all this, and which she got one through this case in 2012, 2013, something like this. Not beautiful enough to marry her under MK Ultra. That's what she wanted. Uh, look, folks, uh, this U.S. president have had plenty of time to get this case solved this first. What the fuck that's supposed to mean that you have a guy sick? to death with a cancer whom you have by the way ruined through the torture when you commenced your presidency already 26 years what the fuck that's supposed to mean and this is the guy who will now wait for what for whom what what am i going to wait for obviously the president like this has got a different plans these plans are coordinating on a bigger picture with the people for whom Vladimir Putin personally thinks will recreate a connection again. And these people are in lines of Democrats, just as are in lines of Republicans. Unfortunately, I have to put it this way. I'm not going to support a politic like this, politic against myself. You had time to solve this. You didn't have to condition with the medications, with a cure to get things done. But it was other agendas that ran your agenda. And I don't see why, why I would feel like I owe you just as I owe anything to black people whom you have involved in this case with idea to collect money, torture, actually torture for the money. And in whose world you believe you're going to push me regardless, force me, compel me into. Just so you can get your Nazi, neo-Nazi agenda going. I don't see the need for that. I don't see the need. It was just a black people that could save me from a trouble. From the trouble that you created for your geopolitical agenda, which part I don't even want to be. I don't want have nothing to do with it. You are the one. It's not because of me that this took place. You ruined my life. I didn't ruin yours. You needed this shit, not I. I went to the U.S. not a good idea to end up tortured in Russia, in Belarus, all over Eastern Europe, including this room here in Slovenia. You were the one. You needed this. I didn't. And as I stated, Joe Biden is Joe Biden. That's all there is. He's just a politician of a big political interest. So watch out. And don't even try with a Britney Granger. That's that's true. That's gone. There was people involved in MKUltra who all the time would say, this is the guy. This is the guy whom you will give this and this and this and that. Hmm. There were psychologists, psychiatrists involved in this stuff that actually don't believe in people. Some of the psychiatrists, psychologists believe that uh, we are just a set of circumstances.
maybe sooner than later. But after 28 years, I have proven to be just exactly the same as I was 28 years ago, despite everything, nothing really changed. Now, I have some deep uh, thoughts about this uh, type of thinking. Uh, but, you know, I don't think about myself anything special. But the way I grew up, I doubt any, any one of you would want to grow up like this. I don't think you would want to go through one day I did in my life through entire grammar school, eight years. From age six to 14, I don't think any one of you would wanna go through just one single fucking day I did for eight years. You wanna go every day and face uh, like groups of kids, like 10 kids, physically assaulting you once, twice a day, live like a little gladiator, humiliated by the teachers, you have no fucking idea what I have gone through, get injections because of physical look, that kind of stuff, to retard you mentally, literally to retard you mentally so you could not follow class play down your expectations as you're being unfit to be in the school you attended and stuff. I don't think any one of you will go through a single fucking day of my life I have gone through for eight years in grammar school. I'm not talking about what went on later on and it was crazy too. But the grammar school, it was something else. You see, that's the stuff, Vladimir Putin, and it's what separates me from you, psychiatrists, psychologists, who stated, well, it's just a set of circumstances, and this and that. It sets me apart from black rappers that violently displayed some kind of, you know, my way, my way, whatever, dope, smoke, get justice now, bang, bang. That's what brought Vladimir Putin to America in 95. He came to hunt for me. He didn't come to sightsee America. KGB didn't send him to sight for sightseeing to America. You talk to my schoolmates, who I was when I was a kid, what I wanted this country, this here, Slovenia, to become when it was still part of Yugoslavia for you to understand one fucking day of my life I have gone through for eight years in grammar school in grammar school alone never mind other stuff and it started to tell you the truth in kindergarten it's not this I saved because of disrespect for you or anything like this but it was just a bigger reason why I was the one and when it comes to MK Ultra I was the one who set the circumstances the record shows I didn't change within the last 28 years and everybody around me did even the people who faced no pressure or at least slightest pressure whatsoever you understand that's why I'm picky about with whom I deal what. Saying to someone under the culture, you're gonna do this, you're gonna, uh, you're gonna give, 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 you must be fucking kidding. You must be kidding. We are not just uh, split the coalition like we say in Slovenian language, set of the circumstances around us. Not everyone is, at least. Thanks for watching this video. Till next time.